tough problem um once i actually got the answer for it it seemed very easy but it took me a little bit a little bit of trial and error to figure out what the best way to do it would be so first thing i'm just going to talk out what i did so maybe if you did the same thing i saw b squared minus a squared equals six right and i tried factoring this out i know that b plus a times b minus a is the same thing as b squared minus e a squared now and then i saw a squared plus 2b squared equals 21 over here and i just couldn't figure out a way to connect the dots from this and this even though i know that b squared minus a squared equals that i just didn't figure out a way to connect the dots and what clicked with me was this i'm gonna erase this and i'm gonna see how over here i have a b squared and over here i have an a squared i realized that if i bring this negative a squared over here then i'll know what the value of b squared is and then I can plug that b squared in right there and I'll solve for the problem. So let me do it out for you. So it'll be b squared equals 6 plus a squared, right? So all I've done is brought this a squared to that side. Now over here, I'll have a squared plus 2 times. Now instead of the b squared right there, I'm going to replace that with 6 plus a squared. So that's 6 plus a squared and that equals 21. So it's a squared plus 12 plus 2a squared equals 21. And now I think I should be able to solve for the a. So a squared plus 2a squared is 3a squared. So it's 3a squared plus 12 equals 21. Let's subtract 12. Then I'll have 3a squared equals 9. Divide both sides by 3. I will have a squared equals 3. And then a will equal square root of 3. Now the question is asking me for the value of b. So I'm going to go back and plug a equals square root of 3 either over here or I can plug it back over here. It doesn't matter where I plug it back in. This one seems a little bit easier, so I'm gonna plug it back in this one. So b squared minus square root of three squared equals six. Square root of three squared is just three. So that's b squared minus three equals six. Then add three on both sides. So b squared will equal nine, and then b will equal three. You might be thinking that b could equal plus or minus three. But a couple of things, A, negative 3 is not in the answer choices, and the question says A and B are positive numbers, so um, B equals 3 is the only one that would work. Tough problem, on a scale of 1 to 5, I'd say it's level 4, but there's really substitution here. So once I solve for B squared, I can throw the B squared in right there, and then go ahead and solve for the rest.